the last item of installing the TU-53 or 5400 process turbidimeter is configuration of analog or digital outputs for communication of the turbidity readings to a programmable logic controller or other control system. We'll demonstrate the analog output settings on the SC-1000. Digital settings such as Modbus or Profibus registers can be downloaded from www.hawk.com. We start by pressing the main menu and scrolling down to the SC-1000 setup where the output menu resides if a analog output module is installed inside the SC-1000. If it is, you'll get an output setup screen. We press that, press the check mark, and notice we have a milliamp output card that is internal to the probe module. We select it, and we can expand it out to four 4 to 20 milliamp outputs. We'll select the first. Configuration is easy. It starts with selecting the proper source. The source in this case is the sensor that we're working with, the TU5400SC. So we'll choose that and press the green check mark. Notice the parameter that we're going to monitor is turbidity and NTU. And if we scroll down, our scale can either be between 0 or 4 and 20 milliamp. So we'll change that to 4 to 20 milliamp, which is typical. And then our last setting is the low and the high value. The low value is the concentration in NTU that will be equivalent to 4 milliamps. 0 NTU is appropriate in this case. The high value in NTU is what will be equivalent to 20 milliamps. And even though the TU5400 can measure much higher concentrations, we are going to change the high value in this case to 1 NTU. So we'll type in 1.0 NTU, accept our work, and that's it. We can go all the way back to the home menu by pressing the home icon, and we're done. This completes the simple installation of the TU5400 process turbinimeter using the SC1000 controller.